what's up youtubers how you guys doing just want to talk about yesterday's debate really quick and um, how once again we didn't get many uh, questions answered you know these debates seem to turn into an accomplishment thing you know what I mean I accomplished this or I, I used to do this or I did that you know or they bring up old things from the past instead of answering the questions that the people are asking you know if you notice um, there's a lot of deflection going on especially when it comes to the Chinese in the CCP yeah I just have to understand that the Chinese are doing a lot of horrible things right now but for some reason Biden's side won't say a single thing against them not one single thing and rest assured it's all financially you know motivated of course you know what I mean but you know the Chinese got this thing called the Belt and Road Initiative where they literally you know talk you into putting a port or something <laughs> you know what I mean in your country and next thing you know they own a part of your country you know they're obviously fishing out the oceans in the South China Sea and are moving down south more even now going to other people's territories literally bullying their fishermen nobody says anything we're talking about hundreds and hundreds of Chinese fishing fleets that are clearing the bottom of the ocean floor literally with nets they're just dragging nets collecting everything destroying anything and everything that gets caught in those nets people are fighting them off but nobody retaliates with military force yet why because of the Belt and Road Initiative it's almost like you know all these countries messed up by signing over some of their you know properties over to China now China thinks that they can go ahead and invade their territory and literally destroy ecosystems they're literally destroying our way of life and nobody says anything about it you know they harvest organs out of prisoners over there out of their slave camps you know for their CCP members Biden has nothing to say about it it seems that Biden and Harris because her husband's involved with them financially and Biden's always been involved with them financially that they'll never take a stand against China you know China is really to blame for our outbreak but when asked how we're gonna deal with the response one side's very tough which is Trump and then Biden's side is very passive pushover which will ultimately lead to China taking us over you guys do realize that just like they took over Hollywood that's why if you notice you're seeing a lot of Asians on, on TV right now and, and ARP insurance and things like that completely advertising a whole entire Chinese family instead of you know what I mean <laughs> so it's like it's blatantly obvious what's going on out there and um, for the part after this is quickly what I want to talk about the part after with CNN if you ever watched uh, which I don't watch CNN but I specifically watched to see what they would say right after the debate and they had the undecided it was a group of people that were so-called undecided before you know yesterday's debate and um, you could tell that that was the biggest BS I'm just telling you guys see CNN everybody saw that that was the biggest BS you obviously had a bunch of Biden supporters out there none of them were for Trump they all spoke if anything against him even though he didn't do that bad of a job yesterday they, they all those people that you had up there were obviously people that were pro Biden and I think that's really grimy for you guys to mislead the public that way a lot of the news has been doing that and all they talk about and all Biden talks about is the virus when you ask him about the plans that he has for the future this night doesn't say anything it just talks about the virus and I'm kinda sick of hearing about the virus you know the virus has been it's ruined our lives so to for me when I'm watching uh, this old man up there defending China still and won't say a bad thing about them or Harris won't say a bad thing about them it really fucking pisses me off and it lets me know that they're not pro-America they're pro-China they're pro anything else that has to do with bringing in income it doesn't matter how much it destroys the planet our oceans anything and that's something you guys need to think about they're very invasive and they're literally hack us all the time they steal from us you know that they do they send uh, drugs over here fentanyl made in Wuhan Biden Harris have nothing to say when asked about their stance on China nothing and it's nauseating thank you guys for taking the time to listen to this it's just my opinion and um, be safe and, and protect your families after this election because I feel like it's gonna get very ugly be safe God bless you guys.